Hello everybody. If you ever watch Esther Hicks, who channels Abraham, you're familiar with the law of attraction. If you didn't watch, I uh, sometimes I post on Facebook and Google Plus, especially Google Plus. It's like a bigger audience, I think. And um, you can see some work that I think is truly interesting. I put it there. And why am I today about this? Because one of my dear friends called me and said, you know something, what happened is, uh, the lighting is, you see, it's coming from the back. What happens is that his car, in the middle of the night, coming out of the gym, got broken. Now we're talking hundreds of dollars to fix it, and Yes, the first reaction is, and hopefully only the first in most cases, is, I cannot believe this. I'm really upset. There's so much money. Why is this happening to me now that I have so many problems as it is? And yes, we can be upset as long as, you know, for as long as the cows come home. But that will do us not much good. <laughs> if that could solve the problem, that would be just great. I would say, get upset. And it's we're humans, so um, naturally that's the first reaction. Uh, but uh, if you turn the situation, which that's exactly what I always do, really quickly, I switch to, okay, so what am I grateful for? And somebody would say, you crazy? How can you be grateful for anything in this kind of situation? It's a total loss. Money, time, and energy. Okay. And I say to that, I think you should be grateful. And that's exactly what, what he has done. Um, that this happened by your house, not in the middle of a highway, far away from home. Especially thinking about taking, taking a long, uh, trip and that could happen on I-95 let's say right because that's an east coast that would be a headache bigger money and more time and energy wasted although that probably would be lesson too different kind of lesson when that happens, maybe we're supposed to be in that place at that time and learn something. But here we're talking about this one. So um, that was close to home. That was exactly the amount that he had in his little jar to for the um, some trip, some some pleasure. And yes, it's maybe not a pleasure at this moment, but the money is already there and it's the exact amount. And if this is fixed now, next time the trip is taken somewhere further away, he will know for sure that that is fixed and maybe something else now being looked at 
and it's gonna prevent from a big time headache so you see when you look now from this vintage point it doesn't look that bad now it's not just positive but it's a blessing and no matter what happens in our lives it happens for a reason this whole life is a series of lessons that's why we're here to learn to learn as much as we can so in a time of adversity let's don't despair let's learn and be grateful for these lessons and always remember, no matter what, it could be worse. Love you all. Kisses and hugs. Virtual. <laughs> and talk to you next time.